Hi, I'm Chris Guerreri. I'm one of the co-founders of Victor Innovations Company. I wanted to put together a video today to help you answer for your customers the most logical question they should ask when you're showing them our sprayer. That is, why should I buy an electrostatic sprayer and what's it going to do for me uh, if I use it out in the field? We put together just a quick demo that will demonstrate our three basic self selling points on our sprayer. The first one is, how do I save you time? The second one is, how do I give you better coverage so I know that when I'm laying down a disinfectant, I get the best kill claims and the best kill rate that I want? And thirdly, uh, by using less chemical per square foot, how can I save you money? Now let's get on to the demos. In this first demo, you'll see that I'm using an HVAC pipe, uh, vent pipe that you could find at any home improvement store. As I spray the electronic sprayer across the top of the vent pipe, the first thing you'll see is a really nice even coating of spray applied to the top of the vent pipe. As I flip the pipe around, you'll see that some of the droplets have found their way to even give a nice coating on the bottom side of that. That's because the vent pipe is negatively charged naturally and by the way I'm holding it. And thirdly, you'll see that's because the particles don't want to hang out in the air, they literally will come back into the vent pipe and start to coat the inside of the pipe. In this video, I'm actually turning off the electrostatic sprayer uh, and having it spray without the electrostatic charge. As I do this the same way I did the last demo, you'll notice that I get a pretty nice coating of spray across the top of the, the uh, vent pipe, but underneath the pipe and inside the vent pipe, I don't get any spray at all, clearly demonstrating that there's a benefit to using electrostatic sprayers. The next video I put together really to show you and dispel some of the rumors that are out there with our sprayers. We have some competitors saying that if you use gloves, you will not get an electrostatic charge with our sprayers, but that's just simply not true. In the first demo, I'm using a nitrile glove. When I spray with this, you'll see that we still get a full electrostatic charge on the particles, which you can see by the full wrapping effect and the turnaround effect that's getting the inside of the vent pipe. Secondly, I grab some PVC coated gloves. When I spray with this, again, you get a great coating covering all three sides of the vent pipe. And lastly, I grab some black gloves. They're neoprene gloves, used in a lot of cleaning applications. And again, when I spray using these black gloves, we get full electrostatic charged particles spreading themselves across the pipe, around the pipe, and into the pipe. I hope that puts these rumors to rest.